I bring you to my bathroom today to introduce you to something that has changed my life, that has not only cleared my rectal cavity, but has cleared it so well that I no longer have phlegm in my throat because everything just flows on down. Here, here. <laughs> something so simple that elevating your feet can open up pathways for excrement to flow. What? Something that will change your life. Something that will make you lighter on your feet. That will get rid of toxins. I have no skin in this game. I have no poop in this water. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, actually, gentlemen and gentlemen, I give you the Squatty Potty. The this is the greatest logo ever. In fact, I will make this the new Tiger Fitness logo with a tiger pooping on a stool. I think that's <laughs> brilliant. Now, you guys have never used a squatty. Right? Never. No. This large Caucasian individual over here has. Yes. You are a vaginal expert. Yes. And as you guys know, the vagina is located in very close proximity to the rectum. Correct. It is. It's true. And that's the proper terminology. Yes. Not vulgar, but... And in fact, they are only separated by the vaginal rectal septum. Oh, very good. Ooh, very good. Oh, yeah. Three buds. Three buds. That's very good. Nice. All right. Justin, you yes. have been squatting pottying for, yes. for months. And it fits around your waist and you wear it to the club. Explain to us the squatting potty. Please. It's really, really complicated. You put it on the floor. You sit down, you put your feet up on it, you put your iPhone on your knees because it's eye level, and you push down with your feet and you poop. T tell us the sensation. Is, is it like this is crazy? So, does yeah. the feet positioning change? change? Absolutely. Like, it's just like going in a latrine. Your knees are way up, your butt's way down, everything's kind of, mm hmm. You know, like open for business. You can't pinch it off. No. You can't even squeeze There's no control. Shoes. No. Oh, it's open. You're, you're no sitting, control? And your sphincter, your brown eyes just looking straight down at the water. Look at it. Brown eyes. It's like this. Like, imagine my, this is my butt. Yeah. yeah. It's like. I never yeah. want to imagine your mouth as your butt. <laughs> <laughs> I okay. never want to imagine your mouth as your butt. Well, I mean, we will never date. Okay. 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 So, I'm cool with that. Well, it comes in a seven inch and a nine inch, as do all of us. Yeah. No, as do all of you. <laughs> we come in 12 to 20. <laughs> as all of you, okay? <laughs> I'm happy with seven. I'll take some. I'll take nine. I'm always the size. Watch out. It's the size. You're all right. It's the size. So, anyway, there are a couple techniques to use on this. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to disrobe right now. But since this is an educational video for okay. Okay. It should be a demonstration. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. This is where the magic happens at the low glider household. There has been so many dumps taken. The machine's thrown. <laughs> Difference between a seven inch and nine inch, you want to measure the height of your toilet to see which one. Oh. There's a diagram on their website. Since we're not to do with my height, it's the height of and my toilet. Also flexibility. Mm -hmm. uh, like, if you're like if you're like a girl who put your feet over your head, you get like a 14 inch and stack on. So if you have tight hips, do you want to do some hip flexors first before you get in there? When I get up in the morning, I gotta admit, it's mm -hmm. tough to get in this. Okay. But I'll show you some things because when you have just socks on, yeah. my feet tend to slip. So I'm gonna show you a method to get okay. around. Okay. Let's go with this. Let's go. So I'm gonna go in here. I place mine right about here. Okay. Okay. Now I go for the crunch effect. So you sit in, just like a good squat. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We got you. you sit in. Ah, uh, get in. Yeah. Okay. okay. Now what I do is I come in here, come in here, I push forward like this. My my anus right now. So open for business. I'm scared. Don't go. Don't yeah, go. Yeah. Don't go. Don't go. I'm kind of getting the urge. <laughs> Don't urge. But honestly, stay away from what urge. What I recommend is a good pair of LeBrons to really get good traction. Oh, that's why you're not sliding. No. And the and you look cool while pooping. This is so important. You want to look cool. Important. So you come in here. You swag when you poop. Am I looking okay on this, Justin? You're looking team? good, except yeah. for where I'm from. You wear your work boots when you poop. But that's because you're you're a redneck. I'm a hillbilly. Okay. Yeah, so okay. You guys can wear, what do you guys wear in Africa? No shoes. No shoes. Okay, we're going to shoeless for you. So what I do right. is I lean forward, I grab it like this, and I usually hold my phone. And so I just sit here, 20 seconds later, everything's clean. Now, if I have socks on and I do not want to remove socks, I put them right here. And I grip. 
come like this. Oh, mm. damn. Like a cannonball. No. Like a cannonball. It's like, it's like you're jumping in the pool. I did but the kids are going in the pool. Forget a cannonball, you're a wrecking ball right now. I say we just sit here and have a business meeting, mm -hmm. don't you? Okay, guys, minutes start now. Cut. <laughs> <laughs> so, but you forgot the most important, and he's going to get to this, but the most important tip is how you put this away. Watch this. Oh, that's, oh, uh, that's clutch. That takes no storage space. See, now look. No storage now, space. Now, let me explain to you while I'm sitting on the toilet right here. You're sitting here. I can clench my butt. That's a bad thing. And my insides, the, the scientific term is your poop organs. The descending, the descending colon, yes. The poop organs. Okay. <laughs> Keep in mind, this is my channel. Okay. We're not, it's meathead. We're not very smart. For now. For now. It's your channel for now. I'm going to start a whole body funny channel, you know? Your colon funny. is kinked. Your descending colon. Yes. It's not descending. It's kinked. So what you do is like a garden hose. You pull up like this. Um, opens it up. Oh. I'm kinked. Okay. okay. And here's another great side effect of the squatty potty. Your butt cheeks aren't touching. Ooh. The wiping is significantly reduced using less toilet paper, which means you're saving the planet. Up here. <laughs> One time. You, you are saving the planet. And the incidence of dingleberries dropped significantly. And you, you know, I shave there, but Justin might not. So his chances of having a, a, a hanging chad, yes. as would happen in the election, are much much reduced. <laughs> but I gotta say, you notice how Mark has very quaintly tucked the squatty potty under the bowl? Yes. If your wife leaves that out, or you happen to leave that out, one of your children leaves it out, and it's 2 a.m. and you get up to pee, you're gonna pee on it. It's gonna happen. So yeah. make sure you tuck that thing okay. under. Put it just, on. just like if you're, a, if you're, you know, if you choose to dress as a woman on the weekend, I always tuck. Tuck. So as with tuck that, is important. The squatty potty recommends that you know it definitely necessitates a tuck. Good. Guys, this is our scientific bodybuilders review of the squatty potty, and I'd like for everybody here to just say who you are because you guys are YouTube famous, or you will be. I am Mufasa, and I approve this message. I am Gui Lion, and I give that five stars out of five. I am pooping, and I am Mark Lobliner, and this is... I'm Justin, and now I have to poop. <laughs> <laughs> With that said, behind the camera is the lovely Katie Lobliner. Yeah! yeah! Katie, how's your experience doing with the Squatty Potty? Decent, yeah. Because... Uh, Cammy has a new record. Cammy beat... 40 seconds today. Yeah, it's about 35. Mm. That girl's always going for PR. Yep. Going for gold. She's a perfectionist. <laughs> yes. Going for gold. Because dropping a turd without it even touching your cheeks, that's not a game. <laughs>